Hi sewing friends, welcome to my sewing room. My name is Beth and if you're new, welcome. Today I'm going to take this quilt we talked about last time and I wondered, and maybe some of you wondered too, what if I make that quilt block with some scraps? So that's what we're going to do today. Let's get started. The quilt block I'm making today requires two four patches and two half square triangles. So I chose some two and a half inch squares and I'm gonna go back and cut some more of the background fabric. But right now, right here, I'm cutting my five inch squares to make my half square triangles. I'll cut four of the background and four different colorful five inch squares to make some half square triangles that I will trim to four and a half inches. And I cut my background squares two and a half inches so I need four of each of these two and a half inch squares and I'll be making like I said two four patches for my Buckeye Beauty quilt block. Some people call it Jacob's Ladder and there were quite a few names but I'm gonna go with the Buckeye Beauty and continue on making my four patches. my half square triangles I will put a background square on top of that pretty pink square and I will draw a line through the center diagonally also on either side of that line I'll cut along my pencil line I'll press and then I will trim all of my half square triangles to four and a half inches now for the first block that I'm making I only need two have square triangles I want them to be different so I need if I were just making one block I would only need two different colorful squares but I plan on making four of these quilt blocks so I have four squares and that will give me eight half square triangles just what I need for my four quilt blocks And here is that scrappy version of my Buckeye Beauty quilt block. I'm gonna sew 
it all together and then towards the end of the video you will see some of the different arrangements and it just is coming out beautiful when you have to choose between a two color quilt and a scrappy quilt <laughs> i'll pick the scrappy one every time This is actually my favorite arrangement. After making them all and putting them this way and that, I really liked the star that these four blocks made. I'll be moving my blocks around and showing you some different options so that you can have an idea of what different arrangements might look like. Thank you for joining me today and I'll see you next time.